Radio 710 Keel is your news and weather station. This April Fool's joke uh, that we've never done. We could not stomach it. Is so nauseating to us. <laughs> it is both really nauseating. That that we've never done it. In fact, but it it's, would be brilliant. It's it's the April Fool's joke from hell that dare not speak its name. <laughs> Uh-huh. It's it's I can't even say it I, out loud. I don't know if I can either. Yeah, you can, but I have to leave the room. We <laughs> were going to go for a whole week. <laughs> no, just April Fool's Day. An hour would have been plenty. Yeah. Lovey dovey kissy and announcing that we were engaged <laughs> to be married. <laughs> Do you know how nauseating this even saying that out loud sounds? And we tried it off the air. And oh, we, tried, and couldn't, we couldn't we, do it. We literally, we went, she called me Snookums. Uh, yeah, we tried to, yeah. And, uh, and I sweetie th- pie. threw up. Uh. All I, every time we would say anything about it, listen, Gary, listen to this. All I could visualize in my brain, mm. this is bad. Mm-hmm. You don't want to listen to this, that Robert. Good. It ain't that good over here. I know it ain't. All I could visualize was his naked butt. Ugh. And I was, oh, it would just looks, make me. Ugh. Looks like <laughs> looks like underbaked bread. <laughs> <laughs> With no butter. <laughs> it's cracked bread, you know, that sat out on the counter a long time. <laughs> I was thinking sesame seeds. Let's go to break. No, when those we come, are pimples, Robert. When pimples. we come back. We'll do what we plan to do. I need to go to the bathroom and throw up. Uh, I already did. Why don't you go to the bathroom at your house?